We got some uh, Within Temptation coming up, y'all. I, I can't fucking wait. Do you always see these concerts, right? I always have anyways. And I'm watching the people, like, with, especially Epica, that I'm like, I'm fucking front row, you guys. I can't fucking wait! I'm right there, front row. I'm like, motherfucker, yeah! I can't wait. But Within Temptation, I'm always watching their, their concerts, right? And... Like with this, the only exception are these kinds of videos and the um the uh virtual one that they did. But I always love to watch the crowds, how they interact with the bands, right? And the the crowds from Nightwish, Epica, Within Temptation, they go absolutely bananas, crazy. And the only reason why. The people were sitting down at the Sabaton concert is because they played with Judas Priest. Now, Judas Priest has been a law around for a long time. So a lot of their fans are of, of the older variety, and they can't stand up for a long time. I didn't sit down one fucking time, y'all. I didn't give a fuck. High heels or not, my ass was sitting. I was like, I'm not sitting down. Fuck that. I just want to feel the music. I want to be there. and just I can't fucking wait. This this year, my concert, the concerts that are on like my like checklist, fuck. I'm so excited. The only one I'm not going to see, which I'm really uber bummed about, is Lacuna Cool. Why do I have why do I have my nose pierced? Well, I had it pierced before I went to prison and I had to take it out while I was in prison, but I got to keep my dermal implants that I had one here and I had one here, but this one I ripped out like a couple months ago. Um when I got to the halfway house, I took a bobby uh not a bobby pin. Yeah, no. No, a safety pin. And I shoved it through the hole, but I missed and I shoved it through another hole and I, I actually hit a blood vessel and it bled everywhere because I've always had my nose pierced and I've always, I like didn't want to not be myself again. So I put another one in and I was like, I'm not going to go to a piercing studio or anything. I'm just going to do it myself. And I did because I'm a badass. Just saying. Restless by Within Temptation. Hi, Pooh. Hey, Carrie. Hey, Diggle. This is the land of Sharon. She's Mother Nature in a in the form of a human body. know what movie this is from maleficent so i love it when within temptation when they put out these videos of the unofficial videos i think it's probably bad as well so pop in hi <laughs> love this it's so pretty okay so oh yesterday you guys i um was driving to my friend's house and i was like on youtube while i was uh, don't long story okay when i stop at stoplights or i'm at like a red you know red light stoplight same fucking thing 
I proved through YouTube videos. And I seen that Sabina was live. I would she did was doing Nightwish. So I was like, gotta click on this. I can't help myself. So I clicked on it and they were doing a live stream, a, a Nightwish concert. I was like, yes. So I got to join in on that. It was so much fun. There was like like 550 people there. It was so cool, man. And I was like, man, Nightwish. It brings everybody together. And I stuck around. I only got to stick around for uh, Endless Forms Most Beautiful and Alpenglow. So I had to go afterwards, which I was really sad. sad. But I was singing. I was trying to like, I had to pull over. I was like, ah, I have to pull over. So I went to the store just because I wanted to sit there and listen to this stream. I'm so guilty. They did a good job though. together with this movie clip man and i love maleficent that is one of my favorite movies angelina jolie oh my god she's not just laura croft but she does anything anything that she does man and she's one of the most beautiful women in the world i love this movie it's one of my favorites they do her so fucking dirty no wonder why she's mad <laughs> To her so bad like i'm i wish i was like i could fly and stuff like that and had magical powers and shit that i can blow people up they make me mad but i can relate to her being stabbed in the back and then just being pissed the fuck off like are you kidding me like i heard some shit yesterday y'all that blew my motherfucking mind i was like i ain't never seen red so fast in my life my adrenaline went pew my heart rate was like oh this mother i yeah so i can 100 percent feel her pain by having been backstabbed and you're you don't re, you don't expect it you're like what the fuck did that came like come from and when that happens to you you know you get pissed off and that's perfectly normal that I, I've learned that. It's perfectly normal to get pissed off and be angry. That's, typic, that's typical if somebody fucks you over. Yeah.
shouldn't have burned her, dude. Sorry. She could have saved him. Like, Maleficent was one of them movies where you expected it to have this beautiful ending, but it didn't. It was dark and sad, and you're just like... I don't know about you guys, but I get emotionally invested into music and to movies. I'm like... I was, like, totally infamous for crying at an M&M's commercial back in the day when Matthew was a baby. I literally did... I did. I cried like a freaking baby over an M peanut M&M's commercial. I'm a mess sometimes.